Matt, in our city, the utilities, including electrical lines, run underground, so obviously they pretty much go unseen all of the time, except for today, which thanks to an underground fire, there was quite an intense scene here on the street. We had a call for smoke coming through the manholes. The smoke calling Kansas City firefighters to 10th and Wyandotte streets downtown. You could see just an unusual amount of people outside looking in one direction. Blue McNeil captured on her cell phone. It smelled like an electrical fire. Just moments before an underground transformer exploded, blasting several manhole covers into the air. The one that blew the highest had flames probably 20 feet shooting from it after it blew. On her phone, McNeil could see firemen and crews from KCPNL using carbon dioxide to put the manhole fires out. Uh, the third one popped and then it was on fire for a while. Yeah, there was a column of smoke, probably seven stories. It was pretty thick, nasty stuff that was coming out of the manhole covers after the manhole covers were blowing up. While no one was injured and no buildings evacuated, McNeil says it all made for one interesting day. It's never a dull Saturday afternoon when you're in downtown Kansas City. Now, KNBC 9 News has learned that the fire started in two cables in a small part of the underground that provides the underground network that provides electricity to the city. And while no exact cause is known right now, KCPNL tells us that last night's flooding could have played a role. Reporting live, Stacy Cameron, KNBC 9 News.